Hello everybody, this is Dalvin Jesterhead247 and I want to do a little navigation, a quick walkthrough through the Xbox dashboard interface. So let's sign in. So I'm signed in. This is the Xbox dashboard. Let's see what we have here. Okay, first we have a home icon at the top. Then we have a community. This is where your friends achievements and game clips come up when they produce them. So let's see. This is the one guide. for um, television and movies here's a store where you can buy add-ons and games Here are apps like YouTube and Netflix. Movies and TV. And music. So let's back let's go back to home here. So here we have my friends list. This is where your friends show up. Shows their activities. This is to start a party chat online. This icon here is for messages. This is for notifications. And this is for settings such as to turn off your console and to restart your console. And here is Snap an app, where you can pretty much bring up an app by just pressing it. I'm going to try achievements here. Put a full screen. And it shows the gamer score leaderboard for achievements right here. It shows all my achievements right here. This is follow, uh, following and followers list. It's pretty much your friends. And here are all my captures on the Xbox One. Now let's go back home. These are my uh, most recent games I played. And um, shows which friends are playing it also. Here, it, Here's my stuff which contains my games and apps. So it shows again all my games that I downloaded or installed on my Xbox One.
Let's go back down. This is the one guide. The achievements. The TV. Films and TV. Groove music. And the OneDrive. Here's the app of um here's Skype, another app. I'll show you my profile. This is when your profile pops up. So you go to customize profile. You can change your avatar. I mean, um, switch to avatar or switch to gamer pick. Showing all the gamer picks here. So again, if you want to change gamer pick, you just go there on your profile. You can change it to any one of these pictures. Or you can make your own avatar and set it as your uh, picture. And yeah, the Xbox One dashboard has come a long way. Uh, with updates, it improved a lot. It's much easier to use now. And I think it's pretty damn cool. So yeah, this is uh, me just navigating through the Xbox dashboard interface. Hope you enjoy this and maybe learn something from it if you're new to Xbox or want to get an Xbox One. Thanks for watching.